This is Dorizon Drock in Black Ops 3 Zombies, but every single round, something is gonna change. When a power-up spawns, active gun loses a bullet. Okay, so if we got some kind of insta-kill, maybe, our gun will just lose a bullet. Interesting. So if I pull in the tram, wait, tram fuse required? I swear I picked it up. Oh, it's invisible. What was that, dude? So is this power-up gonna somehow- Yep, my gun lost a bullet. Interesting. Got a nuke, though. Oh, and another one. <laughs> okay. Just as I was saying about insta-kills, dude. But if you couldn't tell already, we have got random Black Ops 4 perks on, and a bunch of other ones as well. Thought it would make things a bit more spicy. I can't believe we haven't done cause and effect on this map yet. When a gunball is eaten, ability to sprint will toggle. Nothing crazy. Hello, double tap with the Cold War perk machine. Look at that. How are you guys doing today? Let me know down in the comments. Hopefully you're all doing well whenever you're watching this. I don't know why I'm just in a really good mood today. I woke up, I had my coffee, instantly started recording. Just one of those days, you know. Oh, hello. Carpenter causing my whole screen to shake. Very weird. God bless the Reaper collection for letting you have a zombie counter over top, though. When a gumball is eaten, player's ability to sprint will talk. Didn't we have that one last round? Game? Are you breaking on me? Very interesting. Uh, let's go get the shield part. Where is it? Boom. Hello. Oh, hi, zombie. Ooh. Totally not almost going down there. Um, I'm gonna go buy this VMP so we have a decent gun. I never give the VMP any love, you know? It's not bad. We've got the Vespa here. The Vespa's also pretty good, but I kind of prefer the VMP just because it doesn't run out of ammo as quickly. Doesn't mean it's necessarily better. Hello, Death Perception, just in this corner. I love how the perks are, like, randomly placed in the map. It's very cool. It's basically if the perks were actually on the original map, you know? Instead of just only in the Wonder Fizz. Got four zombies left. If we kill them slow enough, should be able to feed this dragon. Dragon D's nuts. Got him. Oh, the mystery box is here. I mean, I could have totally just spun that then instead of buying the VMP, but whatever. Screw it. We'll do that. Why not? We have this Razor back in here. Oh my god, we got the Razorback. Dude, I was about to be so mad. I was just gonna quickly get rid of that pack-a-punched gun we got. I picked up a nuke, but my recording froze. But we got the Razorback. Oh, I'm so happy. You have no idea. I've wanted this gun for so long. And finally we have it, and I'm not just gonna lose it. So yeah, the recording's fixed now. If you earn over 100 plus points, you get a free Pack-a-Punch gun. But I wasn't going to keep it because the recording just decided to cut out. Which is just, oh, it's just brilliant really, isn't it? Oh, the BRM. Okay. Okay, I really don't want to get rid of this, uh, the Razorback. Should we just try our luck and, and uh, see if we can get another one? If we get a Collat, it seems to give us a bonus gun. There we go. Oh, the SVG, the VMP. Okay, let's go for another Collat quickly. There we go. The SVG again? Are you serious? All right. Collat. All right. I'll take an HVK. Not bad. Not bad. Oh, we got dogs. Okay. Like, please can the recording not freeze again. I don't know why it did that. Very strange. Okay, I just need to not go down on the bloody dog round. Please, can we just survive? All I ask. I'm buying quick revive, dude. I'm buying quick revive. Ooh, that perk icon is nice. Apparently, it's killing floor two based, which is quite cool. Give me that, Max. When a player reloads, active gun loses a bullet. That's fine. We just lose one each time we reload. Not too bad. Well, let's go and uh, start working on the rest of the map, I guess. Ooh, a death machine. Don't mind if I do. Can we not go down? And it also means we don't have to reload, so we're not losing any bullets, which is good. Can we just appreciate the design of the Risendrak, man? Like, look at this room. This room right here is pretty irrelevant. Nothing really happens in here except for I think there's a cipher somewhere. So, you know, unless you're Mr. Ruffle Waffles, who, by the way, wished me a happy birthday. How surreal is that, dude? <laughs> like, seriously, thank you so much, Milo. I know there's like zero chance he's going to be watching this, but still. The detail in a room that is going to be completely forgotten about. Like, you just run through it, you know? Hello, stamina man up. If it's Cold War stamina, which I think it is, then that's going to be OP. Hello, PhD slider. Just chill in there, casually. Vulture raid in the back, again. Just amazing perk hidden on this map. Max ammo. It reloads our gun as well. We're using the Reaper collection, which it has cause and effect built into it, but it also has ways that you can customize your power-ups and stuff. Two zombies left. I just realized we should have been filling up the bloody oh, dragon. I was too sidetracked, dude. Was that a perk I saw back there? Oh my god, it's Elemental Pop. It just- Oh, these machines look so good in Black Ops 3. Just look at how saturated and just beautiful this looks. Holy shit, dude. Hello, shield part randomly over here. The Cold War Speed Cola. We've got 5,000 points. Jesus. Didn't realize we were that rich. Wonder Fizz is up here. I think I activated all the Wonder Fizz machines. There's no perk limit, so we'll just we'll get what we ever get, you know? What is this? Oh, it's Blood Wolf Bite. Don't mind if I do. Probably my favorite Black Ops 4 perk. Like, without a doubt, dude. Black Ops 4 had some very hit or miss perks, but Luna the Werewolf pretty fucking sick. Trouble is, I don't want to activate her yet because we want to like slowly fill this up. 
Ooh, slide through. That was close. <laughs> oh my god. How did I not go down there? I don't know. Oh, what is this? Oh, a free perk. Don't mind if I do. Electric cherry. You know, it's not the most amazing perk in the world, but oh god, Luna spawned in. I mean, I love you, Luna, but I was trying to do something, man. It's fine. She's cute. Right, is it finished now? Please do your little breath of fire thing. No. God, she's so big. Look at her. Are you chasing me? There we go. Dragon's done. Oh, hello, dying wish. Just casually down here. I think I'm going to go and pick up Juggernog real quick. Ah, Luna disappeared. Tragic. Oh my god, dude. The Cold War perk machines, whether you like Cold War or not, you've got to admit, they look absolutely stunning. All right, here we go. Start filling this up. Bro, trying to turn on these bloody pad things is just insane. Too many zombies, dude. Here we go. Double points. I want to kill the zombies quickly, but I also want to make sure this is filled up, you know? I mean, we could kill a few more, honestly. Got four left. Okay, we've only got two left now, apparently. How did two of them must have died to Electric Cherry? Brilliant. I said this the last time we played the Rising Drug, but I really wish that you could have Panzer spawning in on round eight. Like, the Rising Drug is so much easier. Well, it's not so much easier, but it is easier than Origins. So why does the Panzer not spawn in until later on, you know? Oh, also, when a zombie dies, the mystery box moves. That shit is going to be gone, dude. And we actually need Mule Kick, which is interesting. I never find myself in a dilemma where I need to buy Mule Kick, but we have this awesome Reagan SMG, which, you know, if you don't know what it does, absolutely obliterates the zombies and has a ridiculous amount of recoil, apparently. Has an alternate fire mode, which turns it into a Wonder Waff, which is sick. Oh, hello, box. <laughs> oh, goodbye. But yeah, we need Mule Kick, so I guess we'll go buy it. Because we need to pick up the bow, and I don't really want to get rid of a Pack-a-Punched gun, you know? It costs a lot. Also, this Mule Kick machine looks pretty nice. I guess we'll open up this door. Oh, hey, box. How's it going? <laughs> the perks are a little bit glitchy, like we've got this random white box at the bottom that keeps flashing, but whatever. All right, shield part is up here. Let's quickly grab that. I think in the spirit of Luna, we should probably get the wolf bow. Seems fair, you know? How the hell did you get the wolf bow again? <laughs> I call myself a zombies YouTuber. No, no, I remember now. We've got we've to gotta do these posters. So let's go and see which one's this. This is like the last one. I think maybe it's the... No, that's the second, third? I fucking hell. Brain issue moment. What about this one? This is the first one. Okay. This is the second one. And then this, I believe, is the third one. Oh, I don't want to go near the pap machine, but I think it's going to activate, sadly. I like to have it up here the first time, but... Ooh, pretty please don't activate don't activate okay we're good and this is the very last one now if we run on over here boom this should pop out the wall and we can start the wolf bow my favorite bow without a shadow of a doubt but sadly we actually need to go to the next round i have zero points oh right yeah the mystery box thing when a zombie dies ability to slide will toggle okay the toggle ones are all right because it basically just means when a zombie spawns in every two zombies you'll be able to sprint but every one it will stop you so it's it's all right because every time a new one spawns in you can obviously keep sliding it's just a little bit weird oh hi luna how's it going funny every time i say luna i always think of hell of a boss don't know if you guys watch that let me know down in the comments if you do but Big fan of that show, by the way. Oh my god, Luna killing zombies gives us points. That 130 as well? Oh, that's beautiful, dude. This perk is amazing. And Mule Kick even shows us which gun is our third gun. That's just... Oh, this game. This mod. Amazing, dude. Amazing. Oh yeah, we can go get started on the bloody wolf boat now. Trouble is, Luna's gonna kill the last one. Luna, stop going on a rampage, dude. Okay, she disappeared. There we go. Didn't necessarily want her to, but... Yeah, we're gonna go and teleport now. Get our hands on the old wolf boat. Oh, I see a perk there. What's that? Enable the landing pad. This is... Vigor Rush. Bullets create small explosions. That's what's in, like, the weapon pack mods. But here, we've got this, like, flag up here we have to shoot, which I missed. Great job, me. There we go. I'm so bad at this, dude. There we go. You have to actually shoot at the top where you wouldn't think it would have a hitbox, but it drops this little skull we have to pick up. Interact with this. I'm not gonna worry too much about the Ragnaroks, you know. I love them, but they're nothing crazy, you know? We have, like, a Wonder Waff Raygun SMG, which I'm probably gonna make a video on itself, like, in the future, but I want cause and effect to be the main focus right now. Also, why am I going this way? If we come over to the Wolfie, here, put the head, the skull on the little body, and we get the little wolf. Oh, it's so cool. 
like another one of Luna. But yeah, now to literally do the wolf boat, you just follow this dog around and you fill up three locations. And after that, you go and like collect the arrow from downstairs in the anti-grav room. And that's it. It's pretty cool. But we do need souls for this. So we're going to have to end the round. I'm not waiting for you to get over here, boy. Oh, we've got a fire sale. When a grenade is thrown, open a random door. Don't mind if I do. Okay, so we'll just throw a few, few grenades. There aren't many doors we haven't opened, so... Nice, dude. Nice. I wonder if it counts for, like, the little... The ones you can drop down off. Got a locus. I'm good. We don't really need to hit the box, so, I mean, there's not much point for us to be doing it, but whatever. Get these souls. Max ammo. We're getting a panzer next round, which is fine. Let's let's fill it up with the ray gun, dude. That should be enough, I think. Come on. Any year now. Come on, little wolfie. There we go. They start whimpering. You have to go over, interact with this, and then she'll go on a walk again. Wait, my shield broke? Oh no, I had armor or something. What was that? Speaking of which, we've not actually built the shield yet, which is uh, goofy. Went to the trouble of getting all the parts, didn't even build it. Brilliant job, me. Come on, doggy. Well, dog, wolf, you know, wolves derive from dogs. Or no, wait, dogs derive from wolves. Oh, brain. Oh, I've got something in my throat. What is that, dude? Insta-kill, don't mind if I do. God, like what? All I've had to drink is coffee, bro. Maybe I swallowed a fly or something? I don't know, dude. Here we go. Doggy done. Getting a panzer now. When a zombie spawns, players take one damage. Oh god. Well, hopefully that's not going to uh, absolutely demolish me. It's funny, when we had the uh, the Ray 5K or whatever it was called, the Ray Gun SMG, we were on this map actually. Oh, hi panzer. Get the hell out of here, dude. Oh god, it doesn't actually deal much damage to you. And I can't see what I'm doing when I'm firing. Please just die. Oh, get out. There we go. He's dead. It's making my screen all blurry because of the uh, the players take one damage thing. God damn it. It's fine though. Let's get some more kills. We can use the Wonder Wolf variant, but it just it kills kind of slow. And what? I guess I took quite a lot of damage then, huh? Oh, well, all those souls just counted. That was good. Um, I'm going to grab this death machine then. Oh, she's finished. Nice. And a double points. Don't mind if I do. I don't know how I managed to die there. I know Panzer is usually a bit chaotic, but anyway. Juggernaug, don't mind if I do. Oh, perfect. We've even got anti-gravity right on this moment. So now we literally just... Oh, we have to shoot in there with the bloody bow and I lost it because of mule kick. Well, HVK, you were nice, but I'm just going to get rid of you. Sorry, not sorry. I know when you buy a mule kick, you get the bow back or whatever you had at the time, but I'm too lazy, dude. Come on, we're going we're gonna to do this. We're going to jump up. You have to shoot the symbol. Oh, God. Nah, it's gonna run out. I'm so slow. Okay, here we go. Okay, there we go. Get on here, interact. Oh, just as the anti-grab run out. Give me that arrow. Hello, there we go. Well, at least we're finished with that now, I suppose. Boom. Now we can uh, get the wolf bow. Silver linings, I suppose. Active gun loses a bullet when we earn 100 plus points. That's fine. Dying wish wouldn't be a bad shout, actually. But why am I even coming up to speed cola? Speed cola seems a bit pointless with a bow. I guess we'll just hit the Wonder Fizz. If I could get double tap, that'd be nice. Oh, I got Mule Kick. What's this gonna do? Don't you dare break the game. Okay, it didn't. We didn't get our gun back. Phew. I was worried it would bug out, dude. Anyway, let's go and fill up the old wolf bow. Ow, dude. What did the, the zombies slap you so fast? Here we go. We're fine. We're fine, dude. We're fine. Everything is all right. Speed Cola would be nice for this gun, actually. But oh, look at all those souls, dude. Oh, hell yeah, that's instantly done. Easy peasy, we've had the way zombies. Ooh, God, give me the wolf bow. Nice, dude, nice. Absolute classic, you know, if you don't know what the wolf bow does, it's basically like the thunder gun. Just knocks all the zombies back, it's very cool. When a player earns 100 plus points, random player drops a grenade. Well, if we could get PhD slider, that would be kind of nice. I'm gonna buy speed cola though. I should have just spun the wonder fizz, to be honest, because it would make more sense, right? We're gonna get it for 1500. Oh, double tap, perfect. Let's get one more then. Oh yeah, see, this door opened when we had the grenade opens all doors thing. What's this? Is this PhD? Oh no, it's Reese. What is that? I see you, I think. So when we build something, we become immortal. Like, I kind of want to try it here, but at the same time, I don't. Let's go Wonder Wolf mode. Zap. Like, it's all right, don't get me wrong, but it doesn't kill too fast. I suppose it's all right. It doesn't have much of a sound effect, though. I just, I love hybrid guns. Hybrid guns are so cool, especially Wonder Weapons. Oh, just... <laughs> Look at that, dude, with double tap. When a zombie dies to a grenade, open a random door. Dude, didn't we have that one earlier? There's like 600 combos and we've had the same ones a couple times. It's quite funny. I was about to pack a punch, dude. I'm sorry, am I stupid? I've only got like a thousand points. I'm broke, apparently. And for the love of God, can we go and build the shield in a second? I think I'll do it after this round. 
Oh, God, that was... Oh, hello. What is this increased move speed? Is that because I got low health? I think it was, you know. I think ICU made me, like, super zoomies. Which is quite cool. I like that. Let's, uh, let's use the RZB sparkler. Or sparker, even. A zap? How many points is this going to give us? Wait, the kills don't give points on this. Oh, that's kind of tragic. I didn't know there was a downside to that god tier weapon. No wonder I only have like a thousand points then, dude. Well, I guess we'll be wolf bumming it up for a little bit. Oh, hello. Tram fuse. I didn't want to pick it up. It was the end of the round. Oh, whatever. When a player swaps weapons, give a random gobble gum. Oh, barely alive. Zombies killed with headshots create teddy bear explosions. Huh? That's quite cool, because we have custom gobblegums on this mod. One of them can just insta-kill you, which would not be good. Crawl space. So we could get the void bow. Let's see. Arbitrary armament. Um, wall buys give a random... What? I don't know. Eye candy. Screw it, we'll activate it. Oh, it's all green, dude. The, the dogs look weird. Activate it again. Self-med? I'll take a self-med, dude. It's basically just like another three quick revives, but it's not the worst. Okay, let's actually go and, oh, give when a player takes damage, give a random gun. Well, we only have two, at least, so but yeah, let's build the shield. How long does this fucking thing- oh, hello, Haymaker. But yeah, we have mule kick, so let's just hold this out. I'm not sure what else we could get. Ow, ow, Dracon. Oh, no, the Locust. Oh, no, never mind, it's the Pharaoh. <laughs> My bad, dude. Oh, and back to the Dracon. It's weird how the zombies are all blue, though. Like, how long is this going to last? Please tell me this isn't going to last the whole game. Oh, we got Dying Wish for free. Nice, not bad. Just casually dropping me free perks. We technically have two Gobblegums at once, so this is interesting. I didn't realize that uh, eye candy counts after you finish. Like, having it in your inventory, which is strange. Also, sorry if I sound slightly bunged up. I do have a bit of a cold right now. Nothing bad, just uh, does sound a little bit flat in my voice sometimes. Here we go. Pack-a-punch the razor back. Oh! Oh, look at this. The red. Then when we change it, it's still red. Okay, fair enough. When a player takes damage, a random perk is lost. Oh, no. And we have a flipping panzer here. Activate you. Okay, we're fine. Get out of here, pansy poo. Okay, kind of demolished him, not gonna lie. But yeah, I would like to keep my perks, if possible. They're all quite useful. We've got Vulture Raid behind us. Oh, a nuke. That's actually pretty good. It's making my game footage look so weird now. God, can this thing stop? Can we put alternate ammo types on this? <gasps> you can? So what? Can I get like turned dead wire blast furnace on a ray gun SMG? Oh my god, it works. Well, <laughs> that's so cool, actually. Oh no! Oh, I lost. Of course I lost Jug as well. Of all the perks I could possibly lose, it was Jug. I mean, we have enough points to get it at least. So it's not the end of the world, but we just go jumping around. I think Derizon Drock, yeah. I mean, I did my ranking every zombies map tier list for Treyarch. And I said that Derizon was still my favorite map, and I think it still is. It could change in the near future, but it just has everything for me. It's just, it's so replayable. Oh, has the eye candy finished? I can't tell. My eyes have sort of adjusted. Nope, it hasn't. It had, I see the zombies. Zombie is blue, definitely hasn't. When a player slides, gain 100 points. See, I like that one because if it was the percentage of the points, then it would be ridiculously OP, you know? Slide, gain points, have like 10 billion. Uh, let's actually go for a Wonder Fizz spin. Who knows what we're gonna get, gimme. It's Deadshot. I mean, actually not bad because if it's the Cold War Deadshot, then it's, uh, it's a pretty good perk. All right, Wolf Bow time. How does this change the color? Just like, just looks more green, I guess. All right, shoot. Phew. I mean, it's only 100 points, so every time we slide, we basically get a zombie kill worth of points, which is nice, don't get me wrong, but I'm not going to sit here for 10 years just continuously sliding. All right, that zombie. What? He just got knocked over. Are you good, bro? When a player loses 1,000 plus points, lose 100 extra. Eh, that's fine. Give me... What is this? Oh, Stone Cold Stronghold. Okay. Not bad, not bad. An electric cherry? Oh, a fire sale. I mean, do we need it? Not really. Why do I have an unpacker punched HVK? Oh, right, yeah, the one that gave us the free gun. I mean, we might as well get rid of this. If we could not go down here. Pew, 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 pew. It really doesn't kill that fast. I was expecting this gun to be a lot stronger for a ray gun SMG. Like, look at this. It's not even fully obliterating the horde of zombies, dude. And there's crawlers. Oh, my God. How about the Wonderwolf version? Does this at least, like, one-shot them? Because it bloody should. 
but I don't get any points, so I, you can't win with this. But it's still cool nonetheless, you know, don't get me wrong. I mean, we don't have an explosive weapon, but screw it, we'll buy PhD. I do love PhD, it's a great perk. Also, yeah, I mean, I think these eye candy things last for 10 rounds, but it has been a while. Well, not 10 rounds, maybe 10 minutes. Is this stamina up? Oh, it is. Let's go. Cold War Stam. Jump over the old zombies. Okay, it's not Cold War Stamina, but it's not bad. Let's buy Elemental Pop next, actually. See what it's like. I see you in the back corner. I'm not sure how much it is, but I'm assuming it's going to be like 4,000 points. Kind of being a bit intensive with this ammo right now. Let's see. How much is it? 3,000. That's really cheap, actually, for Elemental Pop. Like, it gives you every single ammo drop. Look, I just put turned with a non-pack-a-punched gun. And I think the turn gives us points on this mod as well, which is nice. Does it? No? Oh, tragic. That was the one thing I liked about uh, Cold War. Turn would give you points. Even if it was only like 50 points, it was still nice. When a door's purchased, give a random gun. I mean, I don't think we have any more doors to purchase. Oh, there's one up there. Oh, and I got a teddy bear. Are you serious? I literally haven't even spun that box yet. Well, um, let's get rid of the HVK, I guess. What are we gonna get? Oh, no, no, no. Thank you, dead wire. Oh! Oh, dying wish. I was like, how am I still alive? Holy shit, that was close. I see you actually saved us there. But yeah, I guess debris don't count. It has to be door doors, which is, you know, fair enough. Holy shit, that was close though. Zap, 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 zap. Oh, we've got a max. Nice. Maybe you just have to aim with this. Maybe that's my issue. But for some reason, look at the recoil, dude. Look at it. <laughs> it goes so high up. A free perk. Death perception. I mean, eh, eh, you know. Not the best perk in existence, especially since we don't have the salvage, so it's not really that good. A fire sale? Okay. There isn't really anything I would consider getting out of the box, but just because why not, I suppose... Oh, monkeys, okay. Actually, not bad then, because that's the one thing that would genuinely be kind of nice right now, even though I totally forget to use them half the time. <laughs> when a gumball is eaten, health gun becomes papped. How many more perks do we need? I swear we have most of them. Uh, Vigor Rush, okay. Let's actually go and do this. So when a gumball is eaten. Hopefully this will get rid of the stupid thing as well. What do we get? Point drops. I think this is only a co-op one. Oh, we did! Let's go! My screen is finally normal. Holy shit, dude. About to lose my mind. Everything looks so like desaturated now, even though I know it's obviously not. But we have a pack of punched gun now. Cool. You know, I was contemplating doing the Easter egg, but Sometimes you just want to jump into a map and have fun, you know? Not that the Easter eggs aren't fun, but sometimes you don't have to do the main quest of a map to just enjoy what you're doing, yeah? And we did do it last time we played as well, to be fair. So I don't want to do the exact same thing every single time I play a map. You know, I want to kind of do a different challenge every now and then. Ooh, when a player earns 100 plus points, five zombies spawn. Ones like this are cool, because essentially if we get 100 plus points, so if we get a nuke, which is 400 points, it should technically, oh, hello, Stone Cold Stronghold, but it should technically, hello, Panzer, can I finish my sentence, please? It should technically spawn in like 20 zombies. Hello, bloody hell. All right, Panzer, get out of here. We could totally get the Ragnarok as well because we just activated the death ray. Like, look, it's up there. We could very easily do this. Ah, uh, my inner completionist is just telling me, you've got to do it, you've got to do it. Also, we have PhD slider. Why is it not exploded yet? Or is this like a, a normal one where it doesn't just create a nuke every time you slide? Also, am I stupid? I'm going the wrong way, dude. Yeah, I'm meant to go in, in here. All right, there we go. Oh, we don't even have the last part anyway. Never mind. <laughs> I forgot the rocket test one. That one just, it takes a little bit of time, you know? Waiting around for the bloody thing. Vulture raid, don't mind if I do. Might break the game, who knows? Hello, nuke. Oh, I could do the thing I was saying. So look, we got a nuke, 400. As long as it doesn't kill every single zombie on the map, it should spawn 20. So if we look at the zombie counter, right now we've got five. Yep, there's 10. Oh no, it's only one increment. So we only spawned in five, but still, that's quite cool. Bro, Vulture Raid makes the zombie eyes look so cool. Like, they're just so much more glowy, you know? When a power-up spawns, Gun gets a random AAT. So we might get, like, a, a turned or something. Oh, here we go. PhD Slider. That was sick. Oh, my shield broke. PhD Slide. Hey, it actually does work. That's cool. Oh, yeah, you, Vulture Raid. You can see all the perks on the map. But it doesn't look too, like, out of the uh, words. It doesn't look too obtuse, I guess. Oh, God. Oh, hi, Luna. How are you doing? Been a while since you came. Actually running a bit low on ammo. I know we get the old ammo drops here, which is nice, but... Let's use the wolf bow a bit. Using a wolf bow with Luna, the wolf. Very cool. 
Oh, come on, my game black screened. Well, I hope you've enjoyed though. If you have, please leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Check out my cause and effect playlist if you want to watch more and I'll see you in the next one.